Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the long-awaited Master Series for Scum, where we are going to be going in-depth into all numbers. <laughs> Damage numbers of melee weapons and bows, all the guns, all the food values, um, raiding values, explosive numbers, everything. Okay, when we're done with this course, and if we write down all these numbers... We will be masters of scum at the end of the series. So I'm not going to make each video too long, guys. Guys, Like I told you guys, I'm going to keep my guides very short and I'm going to keep the gameplay very long, okay? To entertain you guys the entire day. Okay, so for today, we are going to see what is the best weapon to craft, okay? Right from the start. So what I've got here by me is the normal spear, which is the quickest thing to craft in the game. And then we've got the, the stone spear, okay, which or you can also um, craft very easily because the stone spear, you can get two stones, okay. So um, crafting the stone spear, you can do in your starting location because you need two stones, okay, which is easy, and you need tree bark rope, okay, which is easy and a cutting tool like a stone knife. So I'm going to hit him once in the chest, and then he's going to hit me once in the chest, and we're going to see, we're going to compare the damage. So we just hold our hands up in the air to give the other guy a clear shot, okay? And I'm going to stab him once in the chest. What happened? Nothing. Um, I don't know if you're uh, smart, but we're in the safe zone. <laughs> how, how do we fight in the fighting ring? How do we fight in the fighting ring? Damn, you guys are, you guys are bad. Can I change it? Admin settings? Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Remove. Baboon. Remove. This one. Remove. There we go. Come back. Save changes, yes. Resume. I'm already I've already taken damage. Dude. Wait, what do you mean? Stop it? I jumped off the wire. Okay, it doesn't matter. It's not gonna be the same damage as what I'm giving you. Get back into the ring. Okay. So, according to me, it still looks like a save zone. Admin settings, apply, exit, resume, map, okay, it's not a save zone, okay, here we go. 13.8 damage, lower abdomen. 13.8 damage, lower abdomen, okay, so 14 damage, guys, um, lower abdomen, okay, I'm going to hit you once more. 13.8 chest. Okay, okay. So chest region. I don't really we don't want to hit each other on the arms or the legs, guys, because that's damage reduction. Okay? So 14. Now he's gonna hit me um in the chest. Wait, 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 wait. Let me just get out of this freaking action mode. Okay, so he's gonna hit me in the chest now. Sixteen. Okay. Okay, um, that was the upper abdomen. Okay, try and hit me in the chest. 16.617. So 16.6, .6, guys. So the last one was 14. Okay, 2.5 two, two, um, 2 damage more. Okay, so we're just going to heal quickly and we'll be back with you guys now. Okay, guys, I'm not going to be testing every single club, okay? Clearly, you can see upgrades make major changes, okay? So, I'm going to hit him now with the spear, with the metal spear. So, the normal spear was 14, the, the stone spear was 16.5, okay? And now we're going to look at the uh, metal spear. <coughs> 22 damage. Twenty-two damage. 
Okay, so that's a major increase, guys. From 13, okay, from 14 damage to 22 damage is, is a major, major difference. And, of course, it's not difficult. You need one scrap metal, guys, and the tree bark rope and stuff like that, okay? Now, instead of showing you the club, the normal club, and the club and the barbed wire club and the club with nails. We're just going to look at. We have to compare these weapons with one another. Okay, so the best spear does um, 22 damage. Let's look at what the wooden club with nails does. Okay, so again, I'm just going to go out of combat mode and then put my hands up. Okay, and then wait. I just want to get into the metabolism. Okay, hit me. In, hit me. Okay, that was the head, 23 damage. Okay, guys, so that's 23 damage in the head. Okay, the head is unrealistic. But you must remember that he can knock me out with a club as well. And I'm bleeding, okay? And I'm bleeding because of the nails. Okay, he try and hit me in the chest. No, that's the head again. You're going to kill me. Hit me in the chest. <laughs> I'm aiming at the chest. Okay, there we go. Chest, 22.4 damage. Okay? 22 damage, guys. <clears throat> and I promise you, the, I, I promise you the club can beat that, can beat the, the spear. Okay? How much health have you got, son? 72. 72. Okay, oh, this is just not, this, this is just not a fair fight. But of course I've got, <laughs> wait, wait, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Then you can see the club will, will beat, will beat the, will, will beat, the, will beat the spear. Okay. <laughs> okay. So let's get to the next, next weapons. Clearly, you can see the upgrades make a major difference. Okay. But upgrading a club with nails, okay, it's just as easy as upgrading a, a spear to a metal spear. Okay, 22 damage, guys. Does a lot of damage. Okay, let's move on. Okay, guys, test number two is a lot of people say the, the small axe and the large axe are good options. Okay, I don't believe it. But of course, like I say, I'm learning with you guys. So let's see it. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. The, the, this is the small axe. Okay, I'm ready. Eighteen point nine. Eighteen point nine. Where? Lower abdomen. Lower abdomen. Okay. So clearly it does less damage than the club, guys. And I. <laughs> it's either the same speed, guys, or it's slower than the club. Okay. Um, okay. Now he's gonna hit me with. He's gonna hit me with a big axe. Okay. So maybe the big axe um, <laughs> makes a difference. 22. Okay. No. 31. 31 damage. Okay, that's quite high. That's quite high. Okay, but what I want to show you guys now is um, I'm just going to spawn in a sledgehammer quickly because sledgehammer is your favorite. Okay. So let me just spawn in a sledgehammer. A sledgehammer and an axe is, of course, going to do more damage, guys. But I just want to show you something. So there's the sledgehammer. Okay. And I'm going to take the... I'm going to take the club with nails. Okay. Now both of us know how to fight, but I'm sitting with a disadvantage here. Okay, so he's gonna try and kill me with a club with a sledgehammer. I'm gonna try and kill him with the. Uh... I'm at the disadvantage. You have much better footer and mini speed. Yeah, but I've got less health. You've still how much health have you got? Seventy nine. Seventy nine. Okay, let's go. I want to show them that I've got an advantage because people love big, heavy weapons. Okay, so you ready? Why not? Yeah. 
Okay, okay. I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> okay, guys, what I'm trying to show you is that he's using a lot of stamina. He's extremely slow. I can just spam when I'm close to him. As soon as I stag him, he's dead. I'm hitting him so fast, he doesn't have time to recover. If he hits me, I'm probably dead. Okay? Um, so let's see how much damage he would have done to me quickly. Okay, if he hits me, I'm dead. But I've got the advantage, and that's the same with the puppet or with, uh, or with the player. So he's going to pick up the sledgehammer, okay? And now he's going to hit me. Okay, so that, so that shot does a heck of a lot of damage. 33, 46, okay? 46 on the forearm. He does a lot of damage, guys. But he has to... Uh, can you stop throwing the sledgehammer? Just pick it up. He has to hit me. Okay, come, stand up. Let's go. I'm dead if you hit me once. Did you try and hit me? I couldn't. You, I'm dead when you hit me once with a fast weapon. You can't move when you get hit. Okay, so you did try and hit me, eh? You did click your button. No. But I couldn't anyway. <laughs> couldn't hit. Okay. Okay, so guys, let's move on to the to the last um, craftable weapons, which we can do quite easily if we know how to loot, which is, of course, the wooden sword and then the, the, the metal sword, okay? I've never used the wooden sword, but let's compare the two. Okay, guys, like I say, these guides are going to be, this master series is going to be short and precise unless we do funny stuff like trying to kill each other in a safe zone. Um... So yes, the I've got the wooden sword now. He's gonna put up his hands. That did five damage. Five. Five point three. Where? Left arm. Okay, put up your arms. Six damage. Head. Head? Yeah. Okay. So clearly this thing is useless. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to put my hands up. This is the metal sword, guys. Come on. Get out of the combat mode. Okay. This is the metal sword. I'm sure this thing is going to damage. Okay. Go. C3. 34 damage. Okay, that was the chest. 34 damage, guys. So clearly we've got a winner here. What is the best melee weapon? Okay, clearly the metal sword. But of course, nothing beats this guy. That was unfair. How you much? That How much? Unfair. I couldn't even see. Check this, just check the damage. Just check the damage. Should be high. 48. 48, okay. Clearly the katana is the best. Um, okay, yeah, 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 I'm not gonna kill you, yeah, hit me, there you go, hit me, so I, wait, wait, I've got 62 health left, I'm gonna put my hands in the air, try and hit me in the chest, okay, that was 48 damage, guys, so clearly the katana is the best, metal sword is definitely, okay, the katana is not a craftable weapon, guys, but when you're looking at starting gear, Get your spear to a metal spear as fast as possible. It makes a major difference. Like from 14 to 22 is like plus 70% damage, okay? Get those nails onto the wooden club because it's faster than the metal spear and it can knock someone out, okay? So if you want to... Um, son, please chop, stop chopping up the body. Um, if you want to um, knock someone out okay and have a lot of speed close range so that you can move around him use the club if you want to keep puppets at a distance okay and do just as much as the club then do that and of course the metal sword wins by a mile and um, do not craft the the wooden sword okay I, I i've never crafted it i thought it was bad i just didn't know it was that bad so clearly with the craftable weapons the metal sword is the best. If any of you guys have any starting weapons, I'm not talking about a sledgehammer or an axe or a katana or 
you know, something we can find in the world. We will look at that later. But with craftable weapons, metal sword wins, and you can clearly see that you get at least 70% more damage when you upgrade the weapon, okay? Nails definitely does more damage than barbed wire. I've already tested that. And then the metal sword does quite a lot more damage than I thought it did, okay? And in the next episode, we will be looking at sledgehammers, pickaxes, bats, um, you know, and weapons that we can find in the world and try and figure out which which is the best there, okay? Clearly, the katana is the best in the game, but we're going to see the advantages and the disadvantages of the sledgehammers and the bats. If you guys enjoyed this video, do me a favor and smash that like button. If you're not subscribed yet and you want to see and learn everything there is to see and learn about Scum, then click that sub button and don't go anywhere. Cheers.